the golf ball are here, and in one of my dirty dozen videos, uh, I mentioned that uh, a, a golf ball had uh, some magic marker ink sharpie on it, and uh, it was it would be worth me cleaning the ball. I mean, this ball here, this is the actual ball I was referring to, and um, one of my subscribers said, hey, you know, how are you going to clean it? And I thought, well, gosh, should I ought to make a video on it. Um, why? I would never do this with a, uh, um, uh, a really crappy ball because it doesn't add value to it. Now, some golfers, they really want to have a golf ball that is uh, clear. I mean, this golf ball here is in perfect shape other than, um, you know, this little um, marker on it. Some people um, don't want to buy these used balls that have ink on them. Uh, I'm gonna, I'll be able to remove some of it. And what I use is um, um, nail polish remover. Uh, nail polish remover works great. I'm gonna use a Q-tip here just because it's gonna be easier for you to see. You can use just about anything, uh, cotton balls, uh, a, a rag, um, but um, just nail polish remover here on the Q-tip, and look at that, you know, r right away you can see, boy, it really takes uh, that, that, that marker off. Oops, hit the camera, sorry about that, folks. But uh, um, it's uh, 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 doing a really solid job, uh, at least making it less offensive and um, uh, for, for, for getting that blue mark off. Um, again, I'm... I mean, uh, with uh, a, a Pro V1, uh, Callaway Chrome Soft, or um, TaylorMade TP5, it it really you know makes it makes it worth your time uh, um, trying to get these balls as perfect as possible. Uh, yeah, I was kind of on the fence here with uh, Callaway. Um, super soft. Uh, am I really, really going to add value to this used ball by getting all of this uh, blue marker off? Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, probably not. Uh, but you know, maybe. Um, it's gonna take a while. You know, you know, working on this, rubbing on it a bit more. Um, but a as you can see, it, it definitely, um, has had, uh, a an impact on, uh, the, 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 that marker in a very, very, very short, uh, period of time. Um, you know, uh, again, you can sit here and, and, and watch me rub this for an hour if you, if you wanted to. I'm not going to do that, of course, but, um... It, it, it definitely, um, with a little bit more elbow grease, uh, this ball is going to be cleaned up. Um, and yeah, just a little bit of nail polish remover, cotton swab, uh, cotton ball, uh, just eat, eat in a, in a, you know, a little rag. You're going to be able to make this ball look totally brand new. So I finally stopped uh, cleaning the ball. You can see a little bit of the blue ink still on it. Uh, there's not much left. Definitely not in your face like it was when we started. And I would, I would definitely play with this ball without being distracted by it. So again, this is the golf baller signing off with how to clean ink off from a golf ball.